strength in fighting these fires is that aerial support. And just moments ago, we saw a Black Hawk helicopter do a water drop on a would be fire here at the former Salt Creek Golf Course in Chula Vista. This is a three day exercise that brings together more than 700 firefighters from San Diego and Imperial counties, as well as Mexican firefighters and Tijuana per personnel. This type of training is critical prior to fires, which have taught them to fight wildfires. It needs to be a coordinated effort between local fire agencies and law enforcement. This training exercise started 21 years ago, and since then, the Harris Fire broke out in the South Bay in 2007. Now, wildfires do not happen every day, as we know that they do train to do this, but again, it doesn't happen every day, so they do this to help get the kinks out so they're ready when one breaks out. Firefighters say that while the basic concepts remain the same, host deployments are similar. There's a new technology such as drones and satellites and aerial support that is up their game and attacking a wildfire. We've also added um, Cal Fire and San Diego City is after, has added helicopters to their fleet um, and make it an emphasis on getting those off the ground and getting water on those fires right away, which makes a huge difference to uh, have those helicopters up in the air and get water on them very quickly. During the training, they incorporate many scenarios. They'll evaluate homes and their defensible space and how to attack if a fire is coming near a home. And there's also a model type mock fire that shows the spread of the fire and how to attack. Now, with all of this rain in San Diego County, you can see still a lot of it is that green brush and that green grass. But as it dries out, that'll turn into fuel for a fire. So firefighters say that it is important to kind of check around your house and make sure that if there's any dry brush, especially within 100 feet of your home that you clear that out and also just make a really good defensible space around your home. You'll also want to sign up for Alert San Diego. You can find that in your app store on your phone. It is incredibly helpful. Well, it will give you alerts if a fire is nearby, evacuation centers, as well as evacuation routes, and also just more ways that you can try to build some defensible space around your home. Reporting live in Chula Vista, Abby Black, CBS 8.